Hello Bronx, I'm Jerry Franzer for the Pan American. We're here at the UTPA baseball game against the Texas A&M University Corpus Christi Islanders. Now, the Bronx are 9-1 and, and are currently tied for best 10 game start in program history. We are fourth in so far in the NCAA with a team batting average of .338. Senior Roger Bernal is ranked 7 among the individuals. Now let's see how tonight's game goes. We're here with Athletic Director Chris King. Now last week the boys had a win against the Aggies. How do you feel about that? Well, I think it's fantastic for the program. It's fantastic for uh, our athletics department as well as the university. Anytime you can go on the road and beat a uh, Big 12 team, ranked number eight in the country, I think it's a an exciting thing, not only for the team, but I think for the community as well. Um, now, um, this coming week, they're going to start their road trip, their six-game road trip. Um, the first, they play New Mexico University. How do you feel they're going to do? Well, you know, I mean, it's, it's always tough when you get on a bus, take your first long bus ride. They're going to go out to and play New Mexico State for four games. And then they, they come back and they play a very strong University of Texas San Antonio team. And then the next night they got to go and play one of the top 20 teams in the country, uh, the, the uh, uh, Texas uh, Longhorns. So, you know, what's tough is playing the Texas Longhorns on the back end of the trip after the long bus ride. But I know the guys, the adrenaline will pump, and I think they'll be pretty excited to, uh, to get out there on the road and get a couple W's for the, for the Bronx baseball team. Coach Mantrana, um, how was the game tonight? Well, we played uh, two games tonight. Uh, the first one we played really well. We pitched well, we hit well, played good defense. Um, the second game, even though we won, we're a little bit sloppy on the mountain. We've got to get better pitching um, if we're going to do what we need to do. Do you feel that there's a rivalry just because Corpus Christi is pretty close to us? Yeah, that's our, our nearest Division One school, so there's definitely a little rivalry between Corpus and ourselves. We're here with player Angel Ibanez. How was the game tonight? Uh, the first one or the second one? Well, I guess both. Tell me about both of the games. Both. Well, the first one, we came out strong. You know, we weren't as tired, but as the game went on, and then the second one just kind of dragged on, I guess, with all the pitching changes and everything. But uh, we stuck through it, and we fought it off, and we got the other W. Now you guys have a long road trip coming up. Um, how are you preparing for that? I mean, you guys are going to be gone for a while, and... You know, you guys are playing big schools, uh, New Mexico State, UT, UTSA. How is that going to be for you? We're looking forward to it. We're getting our rest, and we're looking forward to this long road trip. And the teams that we do play, we're, we're ready for them. We're here with player Roger Bernal. How was the game tonight? Uh, it was a good game. The first game, we did really well. Second game, they did well, too. And it was a close game, but we pulled it through. Um, do you think you guys could have done anything better the second game? Because, I mean, the first the first game you guys played, um, you guys ended it pretty fast, and this game kind of dragged on. I mean, why did that happen? Um, that's just baseball. You know, one game's good, next game could be bad. And like I said, both teams played good the second game, so as long as we come out the one. <laughs> Today's doubleheader against Texas A&M University, Corpus Christi Islanders, was a great success for the Bronx. The first game was 11-1, and the second game was 11-9. Now, the Bronx have a six-game road trip, the first four will be against New Mexico State University at 7.05, 7 p.m., excuse me, on Friday. I'm Drew Franzen for the Pan American.